Hey guys, it's Coach Gav from Five Steel PC, and today we're gonna work on the 1v1 fake or jab drive. Here it is. <laughs> Now guys, in the other videos that we did for the jab and the fake, all I did was shoot, okay? Apart from the challenges, but at the end, all I did was shoot. But in basketball, you can do anything you want. You don't follow the same route all the time and go always jab and then shoot. Or go for a fake, go off to the side and then shoot. There's different ways, different things you can do towards the basket. Especially when you're in a game situation, anything can happen. So you need to be able to adapt yourself and read the defender and go towards the basket. So now guys, this video is for people who can do right and left hand layups. They know what a jab and a fake is and how to do them. If you don't, simply just look in the previous post and check them out. Now what we're going to do is firstly we're going to go on for that jab and then go round and drive to the side. But there's a few points I want to make sure it's clear. Here it is. Make sure when you're doing these moves, you're close towards the fender so it's easier to fool them. Now when you do this jab, you want to go off to the left and then quickly go to the right. You want to be slow and then move fast. You want to change that tempo. Now same on the right, we're going to change that tempo. We're going to go slow toward the right and then we're going to move quickly towards the left and get a step ahead of the defender. If you've got a step ahead, you're a step closer towards that basket for an easy layup. Now guys, we're gonna go into that fake. It's gonna be exactly the same as the shot in the previous post I posted, but it's gonna be a drive instead. Here it is. Now guys, same with any move we do in basketball, wanna make sure we've got the triple threat position before we move. Wanna make sure that's locked in before we go and do anything to make sure we're protecting the ball. Now guys, what I should have said for the jab is make sure you're close as you can towards the defender when you're driving towards the basket. As the closer you are, the less time they have to react and get in front of you and defend you. Now guys, if that was too easy for you, what we're gonna do is make sure we can flow between a fake and a jab. Because as we all know, if we try to do something once, a defender's gonna see and block us the next time. So if we do something like a jab and get around them, they're able to see, oh, that person can do a jab. So next time when we do a jab, they're gonna get in front of us. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a jab, then a fake, and then go for a drive, okay? So if we go for a jab first time, we'll try something else the next time. So let's go. Now the same with the jab, we wanna make sure we're moving slow and then moving fast, okay? So we wanna make sure we're fooling the fender, we're going up for that shot, but then we rip it low and moving for that step and going straight towards that basket. So for the fake, when you're going up and you're ripping down, you wanna make sure your shoulder is brushing their shoulder as you drive by them to make sure you're going up and they can get to you and you get an easy layup. Challenge time. Basketball is about having fun and trying new things. And so far we're doing right hand layup, left hand layup with a fake and a jab. But I want you guys to be creative and try new things. So we're gonna try and do reverse layups, power layups, jelly, whatever you gotta do. Just try it and go for it. Let's go. that video if you want to see how to read a defender though just comment down below or message me and we'll try and figure something out have fun and challenge yourself